a very big welcome to you to Vicarage Road. Delighted to have your company, and I'm delighted to have the company of Alan Smith. Watford in our game today against Sunderland. Here's Watford, and this is how they're going to line up. Well, we put it up, and what looks, Alan, very defensive, but there's flexibility, isn't there, in the side? Yeah, and I think with his shape, so much depends on the wing-backs, how much they are allowed to get forward and what they can do when they do get forward. Played into the middle. This is the Sunderland team for you today. He looks as though the manager has set up a team here. Whatever happens, we're not going to be beaten today. Does look that way, doesn't it? And uh, I hope... It's not adult affair, this, because we've seen these managers set up teams in the past and just concentrating on a clean sheet. Into the attacking third. In quickly. That's a good spot by the defender. And it will go into the middle now. He worked hard to get the cross in, but it didn't reach any of his teammates arriving in the middle. Pereira. Pereira. Strong challenge. Nordin Amrabat. Throw in to come. Spotted well by the defender, cut it out. Hunter. Well, the ball deserved perhaps a better response from his teammates in the middle. The defender got there first, though. Now Jones. Well, they're going to start from the back, because it's a back pass to the keeper. And here's O'Shea. It goes out wide again. And in goes the cross. He could do a better cross than that, I think. And it was easy to cope with. That's the way to win the ball back. Great place to win it back. Good pass, getting it forward. They stopped him in the nick of time. Just lent the ball to his mate and got it back again. Sunderland wondering whether they can go on and score from here. Came in with the challenge and the ball broke free. They've got a great understanding, this team. Just look at the passing. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. Here's a chance to attack. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. Try one now, and it's a goal. They've scored here, and they are now in the lead. Well, he knew exactly where the goalkeeper was going, and he just steered it past him into the bottom corner. Yeah, he's a fine finisher, this boy, and uh, never panics, passes it into that corner. And that has opened the scoring, 1-0 here. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Throw in now. Etienne Capu. Pereira. Good through pass. And it's a shot now. He's had to go full stretch. Wabi Kazri. Pereira. A timely challenge. Berami. Pereira. 
excellent passing, great interplay. I think that's what the professionals call overplaying. Too many passes, possession squandered. Sharp piece of attacking play from Sunderland. Well, they've wasted that crossing position, haven't they? Easily cleared. Berami. Nordin Amrabat. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. It's good to know how much longer there is. This wasn't always the case, certainly when I started commentating. We've got two added minutes. Etienne Capu. Well, there's going to be an alteration now, and with the team trailing, you can understand why he's going to make it. Tackle goes in. Attacking now. The ref blows for the free kick. Referee said, you're off. And now it's going to be an even tougher ask to try and turn this back their way. Yeah, the manager giving his player daggers there as he walks off. And I wouldn't be surprised if he finds him too. They've coped with it well defensively. And he passes back to the keeper. Wabi Kazri. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. In quickly. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Well, that's a clever pass. Well, that looked promising, but he's been stopped. Well, activity on the Sunderland bench. Through pass. Here's a chance. Out in front of goal. Terrific stop. And that will be a goal kick. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Rodwell. Into the attacking third. And in he goes with the tackle. Well, this is how this team can play. Sustained attacking football, but when they lose it, as they've done now, it's just a risk that they might get caught out. This is how they love to play on the break. Rodwell! And they have scored. And they do lead now by two. And they've worked very hard for this. It should get them across the line at the end of the match, we'll see. Well, one team is very happy here, and one team is very frustrated. And yet, you wouldn't have expected that kind of gap between these two. They deservedly lead. Well, they've knocked the ball about well, Martin, and uh, knocked it about with confidence. And as you say, they're two evenly matched sides, so that's been a big achievement for them. Substitution that the home side want to make. Alex Hunter. Fabio Borini. Sunderland wondering whether they can go on and score from here. Well, the goalkeeper will hope that it stays like that throughout the game. Room for the cross. He's better usually at crossing than that. It was a defender who got there first quite easily, actually. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. And it will go into the middle now. Hunter! And he's taken the chance. It's Alex Hunter. Well, what a well-worked goal, Alan, by Sunderland. Well, it was a great delivery into the box from that left-hand side. Where they looked dangerous. The timing was great, and the bravery to get ahead of his man. It was some header. That's given them a comfortable situation here. 3-0 as the game gets underway. Crushing it here. 
Moving from one side to the other. Well, here comes the support. Well, the ball deserved perhaps a better response from his teammates in the middle. The defender got there first, though. The shot's on! Now we have a corner to come via that deflection. And he goes for goal with his head. Great stop. The home team about to make a change. Now the countdown is to ten minutes left. This has been called a football match, but it hasn't been much of a match-up between the two sides. The winners conclusively at their best, and the losers just aching to hear the final whistle now. Igalo, little piece of interplay between the two. On to the attack now. And he's got the ball away from him with the tackle. Igalo. Time is ticking away here. Four minutes to go. Bernard. Nordin Amrabat. Here's a chance to attack. Tries the through pass. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Has indicated there will be a minute Two minutes left, Two that's minutes. added time. And shoots! Terrific stop! It's a corner. And heads it towards goal! Looks like you're getting on your game out there, Hunter. I like what I'm seeing. I feel good. Really good. Well, it shows on the pitch. Keep it up, yeah? Yeah. Right now, I'm just focused on improving my game every week. Good attitude, Hunter. Keep that mindset and you'll go far. That's all I want. Hi there, a Premier League game for you today. I'm Martin Tyler, and to call the action alongside me, Alan Smith. Coming up for you, Leicester City against Sunderland. Sunderland's recent history has been amazing. <laughs> they have managers, they've kept them up, and they've lost their jobs straight afterwards. No one's been able to really sustain a, a period of being in charge of the club, but the most important thing for the fans is they've avoided relegation miraculously. See, to take the lead, it is a miss, a narrow miss. 
Otherwise, we'd have been talking about one of the goals of the season. Well, they cut through the defence on the breakaway, and all it needed was a composed head at the end. Billy Jones. Good football between these two. Nice passing. Bernard. Hunter. Trying to find an opening. Not panicking. Cross coming in now. That's not a good cross at all. And easy to defend. Well, just to reflect again on Sunderland, Alan, and the amazing record over several seasons a record of survival by the skin of their teeth yeah and you sense it shouldn't really be like that for a club of their size just as it shouldn't be for for their near neighbors newcastle and it's out now for a goal kick looking to pick out hunter Lee Catamar. Patrick Van Arnhol. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Place to try and hit it now. Uh, cut out by the defender. Now it's with Hunter. They're on the attack here. Catamol. He's kept it out. A fine header. Better save. Yeah, he couldn't have connected any better with the header. But uh, really good agility from that keeper. Routine for the keeper. Fabio Borini sharp piece of attacking play from Sunderland wants to get at him and he's got past it it's Alex Hunter saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch corner kick off he's just put it off target just wide of that post well his teammates were convinced he was going to score there I think saw it coming cut it out good work Promising build-up until that challenge. Good reading of the play by the defender. Bernard. Trying to stretch the opposition, using the wider areas here. Doing well to keep the ball. Comes in strongly. Mark Albright. Good reading of the by anticipating the pass. Made the challenge well. Wabi Kazri. The return ball. Oh, he's good at cutting those passes out in that middle of the park. to the attack now comes in with a tackle well this is how this team can play sustained attacking football but when they lose it as they've done now it's just a risk that they might get caught out these two have got a great understanding with their passing Not rushing it here moving from one side to the other well the ball deserved perhaps a better response from his teammates in the middle the defender got there first though A timely challenge. Christian Fuchs. That was a foul. The referee's player has been penalised here. And now he's going to sort out that earlier incident 
and booked the player who committed the foul. Yeah, he doesn't miss much, this ref. He's, he's eagle-eyed and uh, he wanted to give the team a chance to move forward, but always going to produce the yellow for that. Fabio Borini. And he could get away here. Kasri. Well, here it is. The first goal of a game that they have absolutely dominated. Very good play. Defence opened up again, but the difference is this time that they put the ball past the goalkeeper. Good finish. And they're looking a very classy side at the moment. And that has opened the scoring. 1 0 here. So it's 1 0 here as the half time whistle goes. So the second half has started here. Sunderland leading at half time. And we'll see whether they can sustain their play. Well, they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. Fuchs. That's a free kick awarded here. They could have got through there, but the defender was absolutely on top of his game. Gonna try one now. Vito Manone, simple save from him. Sunderland wondering whether they can go on and score from here. And it will go into the middle now. Keeper comes and claims it, and no great risk. And the ball played to Mendy. The shot's on! And that levels it up, it's a goal! Musa, no doubt in his mind what he was going to do with it, and that was to really swing a leg at it first time and planted in the bottom left. It's uh, level, both sides have scored here now. Patrick Van Arnhol. One, two, and having a little game of their own here. Hunter. Sharp piece of attacking play from Sunderland. Attack was looking good. Now the opposition have a chance. Trying to find a way through here. Probing away. And out wide, they were in a good position until that defender acted very promptly and decisively. And he gives it back to him. Well, activity on the Sunderland bench. Wabi Kasri. On the attack here. There's the ball in. Cross is blocked here. It was nicely worked. Free kick awarded against Sunderland. Well, for the Black Cats, Sunderland, it's a yellow card. Just trying to impose themselves on this match, aren't they, Sunderland? Well defended, not just getting across. He thought quickly as well. To be he went in well. The Here's Hunter. Casper Schmeichel. Wonderful. It's a very good effort to stop that cross. Leicester ready to make this change. Sunderland player has been penalised here. defenders between them and the goal but they still got the ball to put them in front and that's an excellent goal they're in front now 
Well, we thought, Alan, we'd get a very tight game today, but I have to say, this team playing really, really well. Well, they are playing well, Martin, and uh, they're getting plenty of shots in on goal, aren't they? They're good value. Off we go again, 2-1. And Morgan. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. And now, Huth. Challenges for the ball. It's King. Simpson. Billy Jones. Fabio Borini. Hunter can go on here despite that foul. It's not given because they've still got the ball. There's good progress with this attack. Well, the ball deserved perhaps a better response from his teammates in the middle. The defender got there first, though. Keep an eye on the watch because we haven't got that long to go. And the team know that. They can't get too desperate, though. They need to keep some sort of poise about their play. Yeah, they've got to keep the shape. I mean, it's not time to further centre-half and the goalkeeper forward yet, but we're approaching that moment. They cope with it well defensively. It'll be a throw. Three minutes left of the 90-minute match. That's very good defending, and the player had nowhere to go. Rodwell. He spotted a teammate and he's got the technique as well as the vision to switch the play. It's Alex Hunter. Sunderland wondering whether they can go on and score from here. The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of three minutes. Here, yeah. it's the goalkeeper's ball. <laughs> and it's over. And Sunderland on the right end of this result. Well, sometimes you get a win by nicking the result, really, but not today. So, Alex, man of the match. A special game for you? Or just another day at the office? I'm just happy to have contributed today, Karen. This league is so competitive, the pace so fast. I just try to go out there every match and focus on playing my role for the team. Getting man of the match, that's just a bonus. So a yellow card for you today, Alex. What are your thoughts on the booking? I feel like it was the proper call. I went in a little hard and got booked for it. Um, I just need to be more aware in those types of situations. It's all part of learning to compete at this level. So you're on a run of good form right now, Alex. What's the key to your success? I find if I listen to the gaffer's advice, things go pretty well for me. He's been doing this a long time, and I think he's got a good idea how to get the best out of his players. And we're done. Much appreciated. You're welcome. Cheers. Practice makes perfect, lads, and perfection is what we're after. Let's get it done. 